What's up, dudes? Here we are at Michael's. We're picking up some writ dye so that I can dye some scales. That's what we're doing today. Um, go to any craft store, Michael's, Hobby Lobby, uh, whatever craft store or fabric store maybe. Um, it is technically a fabric dye is what we're getting. Um, it's just called writ dye and it works on scales. So let's go inside and find some. the red dye and we're making a pit stop at one of the only good things left about living in California. in and out Burger. There's always quite a long line. You can see it's wrapping around all the way over here, but it's absolutely worth it. That tells you how good this place is. It's the best fast food burgers you can get. Absolutely. Hands down. Don't even try to argue me. We're almost there. So close to the promised land. These suckers over here still have a long wait. We got it. Look at that bitch. Cookie, you can have that fry right there, look. Get it. Come on, you can get it. You can have it, that's okay. Go ahead. You're such a good boy. Go ahead. There you go. Time to chow.
All right, and we're back. We got some purple scales now, or eggplant scales. <laughs> uh, I probably said it in the uh, in the voiceover, but if I would have left these in longer, they might have gotten a little darker. Um, but I took them out. I think that looks really good, kind of a light purple. That looks really good. All right, I'm gonna see if I can even do this. Which side? Okay, that's that pivot side. Can I get my pivot back in safely? Come on, baby. That needs to go over. It might not happen here. Oh, there we go. I just had to pull down the lock a little bit. Okay. There we go. Okay, that's in. And we can put this side on. Oh, the stop pin's kind of out. Hang on. on, put our pivot in, this is looking pretty sweet, alright, now, let's see, oh crap, I put the pivot in the wrong side, <laughs> oopsie daisy, I'm sure you guys were screaming at the screen. <laughs> Oops. We made a big boo-boo. Um, should I do it? Yeah, I'll do it closed, I guess. Now, yeah, let's see if I can switch this quickly and easily, maybe? No. So it's a D-shaped pivot, and where is it? Come on. Come on. There we go. Yeah, it's got a little notch in there. OK. Nah, this ain't gonna work. It's all it's all coming apart. We're all coming apart. <laughs> oh fuck. Alright, that's okay. I kinda wanted to see inside here anyways. Uh let's get uh let's get a little cloth here. Give us a little wipey down. Whoa. Okay. We're flying everywhere. We're all we're going everywhere. Um alright. We're apart. Now, where do we start? This is, okay, that is the Civivi logo side. All right, all right. Now we can put a liner over that and a bearing over that. Um, yes, or wait, let's see, that was showing. Yeah, okay. Just like that. And we can put the blade on. Just like that. Easy. Now our stop pin goes right up here. Right there. See that? Right there. Easy. Now this thing, <laughs> the lock bar, where does it go? How does it go? Hmm. 
Now what holds that in? What holds that in? That's weird. There's no like hole in here to secure it down to anything. I wonder, no, that's the spacer. That's the one we took out. Let's look in here. So this went right there. Oh, okay, I think it went around that. Okay. I think what happens is it goes in the bottom of this little loop here. Maybe. if we open the blade that pushes up into there and so that's what locks it out and I think the spring okay it looks like that's it so that little loop goes around that stop pin and the spring is above that and that's what pushes up into that little spot in the tang to lock it out cool now I could be mistaken but I'm pretty sure that's it Okay, now we need that. Now this one goes right here. Yes, that one goes right there. And then we can put this liner on. Yep, everything's lining up. Muy bien, muy bien. Uh, is that? Come on. Why do you not want to go in there? It's not sitting down in there. See that? Why is that? Why don't you go in there? Maybe if I start with that one. Maybe it just is like that. Maybe it just sits like that. No, because there's a space right there. Hmm. Maybe it is like that. Well, let's put it back together. Let's see what happens here. Put that on. Um, oh, crap. We need the barrel spacer. Crapola. Can I squeeze you in there, buddy? Come on, I know you want to go in there. I know you want to. No. It's not gonna go. Lots of things to line up right here. Okay. Okay, now scale. Now pivot. Now, body screw. Maybe there always was that gap right there. That looks doesn't look right though. Look at that. That should be snapping in place. The lock bar does come out now though.
is it doing that? Well, it's coming back apart. We gotta fix it, folks. I wonder if I should stop the video or just let you guys suffer with me. I'll let you suffer with me. You can fast forward if you want. Now, why does that not want to go down in there? Oh, is this spring? Oh, hang on. The spring was like halfway up on there. All right, yeah. There was a little corner of the spring that was up on a le on that little ledge. Now we're gonna be okay. Okay. What's that? Piece of Loctite. In the home stretch, where did that screw? Oh, that screw's in. Okay, that screw is in. Pocket clip, long one on top. Short one on bottom. That looks pretty good, man. Pretty, pretty good. Ooh. Nice. And that does enable you to pull the lock bar out. So... I don't really know what good that does. Um, the knife acts exactly the same. But you can just pull it out if you want. I don't see any harm in that. If it bothers me, I just put that pin back in. It's just that pin that was sitting right in there. Well, it looks good. We got a purple vision now. I like the knife better already. Um, I, I, I kind of wasn't sure about it at first, just because of the locks, the really bad lock stick that it, that it had. It's almost gone now. Um, the really bad lock stick that it had, um, the edge that didn't really last very long at all. Um, and the jade scales, you know, I just don't like jade. I knew I was going to dye them, but, um, and the clip, you know, now that I have this clip, I like it much more. Um... So, yeah, I don't know. Um, I'll put my own edge on it, and we'll, and we'll see. Um, if I put a new edge on it, and it, it holds pretty decently well, you know, what I would expect from Nitro-V, then I'll be happy. I'll be happy for sure. But uh, right out of the box, I mean, it's a, it's a good knife. I like it. But there's there just a few things that kind of bothered me. Um, but we're looking a lot better now. Yeah, the lock stick's almost totally gone. All right, thanks for watching, folks. That's how you dice some scales. Oh, I love you. Adios.